So in the world of traditional software development, creating monolithic applications, the architecture is moving towards microservices architecture. Enterprise app development is rapidly changing. And with the entry of DevOps, which is exponentially growing, things are becoming more and more for large enterprises. They are opting for the microservices architecture. Welcome to this class on Red Hat OpenShift with Jenkins DevOps Masterclass for Beginners. My name is Syed and I'll be the instructor for this course. Let me tell you about the structure of this course so you understand what exactly I will walk you through in this course. So we will start off with the very basics, the concepts. However, I'm going to use a flipped classroom methodology. In other words, the very first lessons are actually that you'll dive into the OpenShift platform, the microservices architecture, and you will start developing app and then using the DevOps lifecycle. Later on in the course, the other half of the course is all about concepts, about Kubernetes, Docker, what is DevOps, how does the software development lifecycle works. So if you're interested in understanding the concepts first, then I would suggest you start at the beginning or at the end of the course rather. But if you are directly would like to dive into the course, then you can jump from start of the lessons. It serves two purposes. So if you're a beginner, for instance, then you could start off with the concepts and then dive into the hands-on. But if you have some knowledge or maybe you're a DevOps professional or an engineer, then you can just start off directly from the very beginning of the course. What I'm going to cover is from scratch OpenShift platform, we are going to create applications using GitHub as a source repository. And I'm going to walk you through step by step, not just using the web console, but also the command line interface as well. So we will install Linux, Ubuntu, for example, VirtualBox. So various ways that I want to walk you through. And since I've called this a master class, right? So I'm trying to cover as much as possible in many different ways as possible. Once you're comfortable with the app, enterprise app, development, not so much of the app development, but the actual platform, the lifecycle of DevOps, then I'm going to get into Jenkins. I'm going to talk to you about Jenkins, what Jenkins is, how does it work, how to build a pipeline from OpenShift platform into Jenkins, how to spin up your pods, containers, and so on. Why should you take this course? Well, if you are a beginner, that's wonderful. This will give you the complete picture of not only what DevOps is, but also how to manage applications. If you are a professional, you will certainly enjoy this class, learning a few tips and techniques, and evaluate your feedback. So post them in the discussion area, and that's the best way to learn. So what are you waiting for? Well, welcome to this class, and I will see you there.